everybody so my ak simmons over here back with another youtube video i know it's been forever since i took one but i'm finally here again this time i'm coming back with a decorating video it's gonna be a letter i as you can see in the cover photo or i'm gonna try to put it right here if i put it here you'll see if i didn't i'm just gonna look dumb anyways there's a letter i or you could use it as a backdrop for a photo booth or anything so i hope you guys like this video and here we go the things you need for this video is a hot glue gun tape a balloon pump and about 20 balloons it's always good to have a little extra especially if you like to decorate like me two poster boards a crown balloon and a six count pom-pom puff garland and lastly a box cutter First, you take one of the poster boards and draw a line in the middle. I would suggest using the ruler to make it easier. Then you use a box cutter to cut right down in the middle. And as you can see, this is how it looks when it's cut in half. And I'm going to put them together to make a letter I type of look. Now you're going to go in with that hot glue gun. It does take about five minutes to warm up. You want to make sure you get it nice and hot and put it all the way across the top end of the eye that you're gonna to connect to the bottom end of the other eye and just stick it together. You can stand it up and make sure it actually sticks. Next, you're gonna take one of those poster boards and create six different lines so you can have six different little boards. Make sure you're taking that ruler and measuring it out so each piece is equal to the same amount. Now we're back with that box cutter and cut those lines. It is okay if they don't come out straight. As you can see, mines came out very crooked, but they are going to be covered by those balloons. So just do what you got to do. <laughs> now we're going back in with that hot glue gun. Since my lines were not straight when I used the box cutter, it was harder for me to get it to stick. So I had to use a lot more glue. So if you have the same problem I did, just make sure you're putting enough glue, sticking it together, and holding it tight so it could actually stay. Another tip if your lines didn't come out straight like mine's is the side that you're gluing the hot glue pieces on. Make sure that side is the straighter side. So if one side is more crooked than the other, use the crooked side guys as the outside because remember, you're gonna be covering it. So it is okay. This is how it looks when it is finished and all glued up. I did not glue any pieces at the bottom or top because I was being lazy. Now it is balloon time. Use that air pump to blow up those balloons. Then you want to take that tape and rip it at a big enough piece to put it on the letter I. Not sure why I didn't record a direct video of me placing the balloons inside of the letter I. But you want to make sure that you're doing them at a size that isn't too big so they can fit inside. But also not too small so you where you have to use like 30, 40 balloons. And remember, you only want to use like 20, 25 at most. This is how it looks once you get all those balloons in there. Now we're going to use a crown balloon that I got off sheet in. I'll put the price in the description below. And this tissue pom-pom garland that I got from Dollar Tree for one dollar. I don't know why the picture didn't want to reverse, so I'm sorry that it's upside down. This is how it looks when it's open. And I just taped those bad boys on, and this is the final product. I hope you guys like this video. Like, subscribe, and keep watching. Have a nice day.